So first, we need to set you up with a basic sewing kit. And we start with a needle. There's many different types of needles, and they all have a separate purpose. They vary according to the shape of the eye, the thickness of the needle, and the point. Secondly, the thimble, worn on the middle finger of the hand. And you can see that this thimble is open-ended and covered with a set of indentations. Now these trap the needles securely. Thirdly, we have some all-purpose sewing thread, usually a polyester fiber, and we're going to be using this for most of our samples. Other tools that you're going to need in your kit would include a pair of scissors. I like the traditional stort scissors because they're very light and maneuverable and they have a nice sharp point for trimming threads, but any small trimmer will do. You're going to need some pins. I like to use stainless steel glass head or color headed pins. They're easy to see and they're easy to handle. I use them in two lengths. You have a longer length for upholstery fabrics, denims, heavier weaves, and then the smaller length, which is really pretty good for all the light and um, light medium weight fabrics. Thank you. You'll also need some safety pins, and these just enclose your markings without the sharp point being exposed. A seam ripper is a very good tool to have as well. And if you see here, there's a very long uh, curved edge here, very sharp. Um, and that is very good for taking seams apart and a very sharp point for isolating them and picking threads. You have to be very careful with this though that you don't cut the fabric by accident. Next, we have a measuring tape. Now this particular one has units of measure in both centimeters and inches. And the better ones are made of a synthetic fiber, like a fiberglass, and that material will never stretch or tear. And finally, and we'll talk more about this in a later lesson, this is a cake of wax. And what it does simply is it puts a coating on the thread so that it makes it much more easy to slide through the fabric. So here you have it, your basic sewing kit.